Is the pandemic over? The pandemic is over. 60 Minutes interview said that the pandemic is over. There's been quite a bit of pushback to that uh, statement by the president. Where is he today on that? So uh, just to step back for a second, what we saw during that interview, uh, 60 minute interview, when he made those comments, he was walking through uh, the the Detroit uh, car show, the halls of the Detroit car show, and he was looking around. We have to remember the last time that they had held that event was three years ago. Even as we're talking about UNGA, the president's going to speak shortly, as I just mentioned, we that hasn't been held in, in person for about three Three years as well. So we are in a different time. He's been very consistent about that. And the reason why is because we are now prepared. We are now ready. We know how to deal with uh, this pandemic. It is now m- more manageable. It's not as disruptive as it's been uh, in the prior in the prior years. And so and it is because of what this president has done on day one. Right. If you think about where we were when he walked in, 3,000 people were dying a day. That has come down 90%. You think about schools that were closed, now schools are open. Think about businesses were closed, now businesses are open. And it's because of the work that this administration has done. Now, what he has been very consistent about is that we have to continue to have a front foot on this so we have the funding so that we are ahead of this, of any other, you know, as we look at future vaccines and future treatments. Treatments. We need to make sure that we are ready for that as we're also leading, as we're talking uh, the backtrack of UNGA, uh, as we're leading globally as well. Two members of his administration say Biden's declaration was not part of his planned remarks. And it's because of the work that this administration has done. Right.